Warren, Warren, here. D Dr. Maggie Pierce, this is our Captain Robert Sullivan. Just I think you've already met. Chief Ripley is. He's still confused. On exam, he has a systolic crescendo, decrescendo murmur consistent with aortic stenosis. Passing out is pretty classic. Hey, that's Sully. I'm here, buddy. You may have had the condition for years. You never know when or why you're going to go down. It just happens. Mm, buying flowers. Is he a, a flowers type of guy? I mean, is he seeing someone? Why are you asking me? Because you guys are BFFs. Uh, that's not a... That's not a term we use. I was there. A late bloomer's first responder. He was buying roses and I want to say peonies for a guy named Vic. Vic? What? Damn. Vic. Get out. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did I just out someone? No. Vic is Victoria. Oh, thank God. I'm kind of new at this, and uh, my gaydar is uh, not great. I don't believe this. She would have said something. She wouldn't keep... What? Wait, why aren't you surprised? I'd like to hear more from the doctors. I'd like to do a TEE to get a closer look at the aorta, and I'll, I'll do a stress test at the same time. Ripley and Vic. Damn. Okay, now, now who's Vic? She's a, a firefighter in her station. And he is the Seattle Fire Chief, so I heard with the Chief is like, I mean, that's like... It's like, it's like you and our Chief? Uh, you know, okay, fair enough. Vic. Sir, you're in the hospital. Where, where's Vic? I no, 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 no. Still confused, secondary to the concussion. Okay, buddy, we, we gotta call Vic, okay? Tell him to come here. You just make yourself better. Uh... I mean, just give me a ballpark. Has it been weeks? Months? Vic proposed to you? Proposed? Yeah, she proposed, and I said, uh, nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing? Well, she told me to think about it. So it's open-heart surgery. Right. So we'd open you up, put in a prosthetic valve, and you'd be home in a week. Okay, let's do it. I'll just go see Vic, tell her yes, and you can butterfly me by dinner time. deal. It's a better idea for her to come here. Uh, we can't reach her. Well, keep trying. You said I've been walking around this thing forever, right? What, what's one more day? You have symptoms that aren't consistent with your diagnosis. I need to get a full picture before I could even consider discharging you, even for one day. Damn it. Damn it! But will you stop staring at me and get the hell out of here? Right, just uh, hang tough, Chief. I'm gonna be right outside, huh? I'm gonna be fine. Do I look like an idiot? Like the second we leave here, you're not gonna put on your clothes and just take off? I really thought I sold it. Yeah. Oh. Get the hell out of here. It was a, it was a bit much. Okay. <laughs> All right. Listen, let me do my job. Let me run some more tests so you can get the hell out of here. <laughs>